Welcome to Made to Win. I'm John Latham. Now last week we talked about corn. This week we're going to switch focus and talk just about soybeans and Latham soybeans. And when you're talking about Latham soybeans, it all starts and ends with quality for us. This goes back to my grandfather's days back in 1947. When you open a bag of Latham seed, you're going to see the highest quality soybeans out there and you're going to see quality written on every bag. Another thing about Latham is all the different options we've got. And actually we've got six different trait options right now, which is a record. But we've got the Roundup Ready to Yield, we've got Roundup to Extend, Extend Flex is a brand new technology just approved. We've got Liberty Link GT27 as well as Straight Liberty Link. And then uh, last and not least is Enlist E3 soybeans. So we've got all the different options and I've got a one, at least one of each one of these I'm going to be talking about in my Power 10 here coming up. Another thing about Latham is our ironclad. Ironclad is our strict standard for disease resistance. Now to meet ironclad, a Latham variety has to have brown stem rot, it has to have phytophthora root rot, iron deficiency chlorosis, cyst nematode, and either sudden death syndrome or white mold. So that's a high standard, and uh, we've got a lot of different products, and a lot of the products I'm going to be talking about have ironclad. And then also how we choose products. Different, we've got people in different areas of Latham country. You can see all the different research locations. They're examining soybean varieties of all different traits and bringing forth just the best. And like I talked last week, the proof is in the pudding. You can see we've got 164 first trial wins. Now this is both corn and soybeans, and this is over the last five years, and there's still more first trials to come in. So hopefully we'll raise this number up too. But I believe we've got 24 different wins so far this year and more coming. So really excited about the performance of Latham products. I'm going to talk about the Power 10. I talked about Power 10 corn hybrids and then this, this week the Power 10 soybean varieties. Now this is very tough when you've got six different traits. You can't, it's, we're going to leave something out, there's no doubt. But it's, I'm, I'm up to the challenge here. I'm going to start off with an o, a 0 0.6 maturity and that's our 0643 Liberty. This is a really a favorite of our northern team. This thing is very adaptable. It's a great combination of offense and defense, and it's ironclad. I talked about ironclad, what goes into that. You can put this in a whole bunch of situations. So really love 0643 for the north. We've got a lot of other great products and all the different trait combinations for the north also. It was tough to pick one, but this is the one I chose. Next, we've got our 1238 Liberty. And this is another, this is a proven star. This has been out for several years now. It also is ironclad, very adaptable product. We're seeing it work extremely well in South Dakota, Minnesota, Northern Iowa, great performance. And then having the ironclad designation, you know you can put it in some tough situations and it's gonna do well. So 1238 is my next one. Next is 1648. This is an LLGT27. This is an, also another ironclad. This has extremely high yields. It's, it's won different first trials before, very adaptable product. I know the guys in South Dakota are loving this. They're talking about it on our RSM call every week. So this is my next product is 1648 LLGT27 in a 1.6 maturity. Next at a 1.8 maturity is 1858 R2. Now this is a product also that's been out for a few years, but the performance of this is unbelievable. It has absolutely dominated the first trials in Southern Minnesota over the last four years. And in fact, this year it was the winner of the Minnesota South Summary. And that's the last, each of the last four years that's won at least one summary in Southern Minnesota. So I know it's around a pretty two yield. So you've got to have, you, you can't have uh, weed issues obviously with Roundup Ready 2 but if you don't if you've got that under control this is a product that's just going to flat out going to yield and especially in that southern Minnesota area I love it. Next is our 1945 R2X. This is another ironclad product. This one won the first trial at Lamberton, Minnesota this year. Another ironclad like I mentioned and it's elite phytophthora protection. We've got a couple here that I really love because they're stacked with phytophthora protection. They've got not only the 3A gene but the 1A gene so you can't get much better than that. So love this product across southern Minnesota into South Dakota, Wisconsin, even into northern Iowa a little bit. 1948 round a pretty to extend. Next is 1995 E3. This is another ironclad. 
Love this one. This one has multiple super strip wins this year already. Uh, really excited about the, the performance and very good white mold on this thing. I know we've had a lot of folks in Minnesota, Wisconsin, even into South Dakota the last couple of years had white mold. This is a excellent on white mold. It's going to give you high yield in an ironclad package too. So really happy about 1995 and that 1.9 maturity. Next is 2193. This will probably be our top seller for the whole company. This thing is very adaptable. It's won all sorts of super strips this year. In fact, in Garner, Iowa, it, it won at 89 bushel. So really some top end yield, but it is an ironclad too. So it's got that top defense you're looking for. And then it's another one that's got elite Phytophthora root rot resistance. It's got the 3A gene stacked with the 1A gene. So this is going to be a big seller for us. I would encourage you to, to get your orders of 2193 soon because this one is going to sell out. Next is we're moving into the Extend Flex and this is one I picked is 2494. The reason I picked that brand new technology, high yielding product, especially in Northern Iowa. Our uh, grower in Northern Iowa did uh, 62 bushels and one of the top grower field averages for all of our, our grower production around Alexander. So love the look of this thing. Uh, so if you're looking for a new for Extend Flex, this would be a great one to go with. 2494 Extend Flex. Next is a 2.5 maturity is our 2549 Rounder Pretty 2 Extend. This one has won five first trials over the last two years, three this year and two last year. Really a top end yield on this product. And it also has great iron deficiency chlorosis and stress tolerance. Now it doesn't quite make ironclad, but when you've got that much yield potential and you've got that much disease uh, resistance, you've got to plant this. If you're looking for an extend product, I love 2549. Just look at the first trials and it'll show you how good this thing can yield. Net last and certainly not least is one of my favorites in the 2.8 maturity is 2894 E3. This one has already won two first trials this year uh, it, and it won the Southeast uh, South, South Dakota summary altogether, all the different locations. So it can do well there. And then it also won a first trial over in Eastern Iowa. So you know it's adaptable between Iowa and South Dakota. Uh, love this product and a 2.8 maturity. It is a star. So to wrap things up, this is my power 10. This goes from all the way from a 06 to a 2.8. Now we've got beans as early as a 02 or 01 actually, all the way to a 3.5. And there's a lot of different products. Talk to your RSM about just the products that are right for your area. So with that, I would say thank you so much for watching. Hope you're having a safe harvest and we will talk to you again soon. Thanks so much.